Hello there, fellow gamers. I'm Kevin J, and welcome to the Dream Yard. In the last episode of Pokemon White Version, as uh, the game we're playing, we defeated the gym leader at the, the friggin' the, the gym in Striaton City, and it was none other than Cilantro himself. The evil mastermind behind the entire game was him. We've already beaten the game, ladies and gentlemen. Good night, everybody. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm really dumb, and I'm, I don't make funny jokes. And we're gonna use cut, and the sad thing is, if we have to give it to Lillipop, I will. Oh, Lollipop can't learn it. Oh, well, you know what? I'm not gonna do that then. I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna catch a purloin because I'm not teaching Charles Cut because he can't learn it. Okay, we're back. And we got a new Pokemon here that's gonna cut down this tree. Yeah, I cut things, used cut. That's the only thing it knows how to do. I realized like right after I named it, like I easily should have named it something like. And then I used cut. <laughs> that would have been better. Anyway. Bianca is in the dream yard. Oh, did you hear that noise? <gasps> hey, did you hear a sound coming from the other side of that wall? Come on, let's go see. Step, step, step. Step, step, step. What the heck is that? Oh my god, dude. Oh, wait! We found you, Mona. Come on, let's make, come on, come on, make some dream mist. <laughs> huh? Who are you? What are you doing? Are you talking about us? We're Team Plasma. We bound today and night to liberate Pokemon from foolish humans. What are we doing? The Pokemon Mina and Michonne are made a mysterious vapor called dream mist, which shows people's dreams. We're going to use it to make people want to release their Pokemon. We'll show them dreams to manipulate their hearts. No, oh, no, no. Come on, spit out that dream mist. You're kicking a Pokemon to make you give up some dream mist? That's mean. Why? You're trainers too, right? That's right. We're Pokemon trainers too, but we're fighting for a different reason. Unlike you two, we're fighting for the freedom of Pokemon. And setting Pokemon free means that we win Pokemon battles and take Pokemon by force. So on that note, we're going to rescue your Pokemon from you. What don't hurt Kevin J? We were doing. The Team Plasma theme is iffy. I don't know if I if I like it. But anyway. Oh, okay, never mind. Yeah, it's really good. <laughs> I was like, wait a minute. I don't remember the rest of the song after this. And then like it hits, and I'm like, oh yeah, oh yeah. No, the song's awesome. <laughs> anyway, so we're gonna defeat this Plasma Grunt, and I think I just. Had an idea for um, the next Pokemon I want on my team, and no, it's totally not. It's totally, it's totally not Mana, guys. It's totally, it's totally not. I'm just gonna fact check right here, make sure I can catch one. Actually, that's what's crossing my mind. Now. I have to make sure I can actually catch this thing. I'm gonna tackle it. I, I don't know. I like using tackle for that finishing hit if I can. I miss, oh, I thought I missed. I didn't hit the A button. Oh, do I have my thing set to L plus A? Because I should, or L equals A? Because I should do that. No, it's not set. I should do that. Let me turn that on. And they get their own victory music too. Plasma! Oh, you, my beautiful dream. Were you not taking them seriously because they're kids? Well, whatever. I'm next. Okay. Oh, it was a girl, I just realized. It was a girl the entire time, and I was just like, oh, okay. Wait a minute. See, I like... One thing I like about Gen 5 is they gave it this, like... This really, like, heavy-hitting, but, like, awkward... Sort of, like, tempo to their music. It's really good. It's because it's got, like, this metal sort of theme. This like this sort of like progressive metal sort of sound I should say because like it's very it mixes up a lot of the tonality of it right or rather the, it's the timing of the beats and stuff it's got like very interesting transitions into the main uh, chords and stuff okay anyway hang on I got a fact check here while I'm playing through the game this is me playing through the game while looking at Pokemon stats at the same time bad combination I'm gonna tell you right now. Hang on, I can find this information, it's not hard. Okay. Okay. I just want to see what the odds of finding it are. 
Okay, it's not bad at all. And the next thing I need, the next thing on my list. I can't believe we lost, but we have to obtain the dream mist. Come on, make with the dream mist. Knock it off. No, that move's not that good in this generation. Whoa, jeez, how did you? What are you two doing goofing off? We, Team Plasma, shall separate Pokemon from foolish people. If you cannot fulfill your duties. Th this isn't... Gets us when is... When, when he is gathering followers, or gets us when he is trying to control people by tricking them with speeches. Yeah. This is gets us when our plan has failed. He's about to initiate punishment. At any rate, let's hurry and say we're sorry. So he forgives us. That was really cool. Oh, snap! Came here to save the day. Okay, that's fine. What was that just now? That person called Getz is, the, that person called Getzis appeared in no all over the place and isn't real, right? Could it have been a dream? And that Pokemon. Oh! Oh. Oh no, it's Fennel. I couldn't wait, so I came over. Is that Mushroom? Musha. Mooney. See that? I dropped an item. Did something happen? Oh, Fennel! Well, you see, Mana was here, but Team Plasma and Mana and Misharna came, and it showed us something like a dream! And then Team Plasma... I think I followed that. See, Misharna evolves from Muna, so seeing Muna in trouble, it uses his power to make him dreams! It ruined reality to save Muna! Which means... Wait a second. <gasps> Is this Dream Mist? Oh, thanks, I wanted that. With this, I can complete my research. You two come by my house later, okay? And runs off. Phew, how random was that? Why don't you go to Fennel's house? Me? Well, I'm gonna look for Pokemon I just saw. Hey, so am I. No joke, that's actually what I'm gonna do right now. Uh, I'm gonna run around and collect items, though, while I'm here, because I'm right here in the area. So, hey, look, I got a pro potion. I thought it said protein, because that would have been a good item to get for doing this research, or doing this exploration. Hang on, is there something this way? Yeah, I knew it. A REPL. I do like REPLs. REPLs are useful. There's a lot of items here in the dream yard, actually. So might as well do some looking around. Um, and then we'll continue on with the game and stuff and... Come on, is it the Pokemon? Nope. Okay. So apparently they did just take out L equals A. Okay. Apparently they took out L equals A. That's really dumb. Hey, look, and it's the Pokemon I wanted. Well, I guess I went from sadness to happiness because the new Pokemon for our team is right there is the Muna. For boys. Learn to Nickel's Tackle. It, it hurts, man. How'd you know I was gonna use it? It doesn't hurt that much because you were a tank. Duh. Yeah, Mana is actually a tank. So, I mean, I figured we needed a tank on the team and we needed a Psychic type, so let's combo that crap together. And get ourselves, get ourselves a mana. I've actually never used a mana before. And I was thinking to myself, like, what other Pokemon do I want on my team? Which ones am I gonna run into? Do I wanna use, I forget which one is exclusive, either Solasis or uh, Goth Gothita, Gotharita, one of the others. Oh, come on. Yeah, Gothita. And I didn't really want either of them. And I definitely don't want, like, Behem or whatever. So I, I figured I would want one that happens to be a, a Psychic type. And then I realized, Mana, right as I was doing this, so I'm like, you know what, let's use it. I don't care if it's overdone, I don't care if she sucks, because I have an odd feeling she does. <laughs> but that's the fun of playing through Pokemon. At least, like, that's the fun that I see with playing the main games, is that, um, you can't really screw it up, right? Like, even if a Pokemon's not that good, you just train a little bit more, and then it becomes good. Or, you can use this strategy to your advantage. Three, come on, click. Come on! Mana! Mana! Mana, I will, I will, I will destroy you. I will destroy you. Come on, get in the Pokeball. And if you don't get in this one, I'm throwing the Premier Ball. If you don't get in the Premier Ball, uh, one, two, three. There it is. <laughs> I was kind of hoping we'd get in the Premier Ball. Mana was caught. Now we gotta think of a nickname for this. It eats the dreams of people in Pokemon. When it eats a pleasant dream, it expels pink-colored mist called Dream Mist. It's the Dream Eater Pokemon. There's a move called Dream Eater. I gotta nickname this thing, but what am I gonna name it, ladies and gentlemen? Tough decisions, tough decisions. It's the Dream Eater Pokemon. 
I need a name. I need a name. We're gonna. I had Bobblepedia open. We're gonna continue with Bobblepedia. No, I don't want to do that. I gotta come up with my bad names. I gotta come up with my bad names. Um, floral pattern. Uh, his face, flowers, petals. Uh, uh, do I name it after somebody? Uh, it's a little moon thing. Well, it's not really a moon. It's dreams. What's dreams? You know what? Okay, so this is gonna be part name, part reference, even though, in reality, this character has nothing to do with the character that I'm naming them after. It's gonna be Cloud. <laughs> His name is Cloud. That's a cute name for a Mushrina. And another Pokeball to make up for the Pokeballs that we used. I guess that's fair. No! Stop with the battles! Okay, we got through that. Uh, really quick, we're gonna look at Mushrina's stats, because... Or money or clouds stats mana cloud the mana it's bashful which means nothing good nothing bad because it's that's the average one comes with defense curl lucky chant and yawn so I mean literally it is just all tank moves and in fact if you even look at its stats actually it's a decent special attack it's not that bad um, lily pup does have higher but he's also actually to be four levels higher and only have one attack stat higher that's not that bad uh, and Nichols two levels higher already has more special attacks and whatever anyway uh, we're just gonna get out of here and we'll probably continue on down the next route because I think how long have I been going for about 15 minutes ish with some cutouts in there so I mean we can go for a little bit longer we gotta do some healing up I'm gonna keep the purloin with me although it's not gonna be on the graphics just because I'm trying to heal uh, I'm trying to heal them up obviously yeah, we got our Pokemon. He even picks them up and puts them in his bag, cause that's what you do with Pokemon. Actually, what am I doing? I'm not. I just said I'm not putting the purloin away, and then here I am trying to put the purloin away. Can I pick them up and move them? No, you can't do that. Uh, we're gonna put Cloud in the front, followed by Nickel, followed by Charles. What item did he get? A hyper potion? That's pretty useful. Thanks, Charles. Good job, Charles. Always always helping out the team. That's why we're gonna keep him for pickup. Even though I'm pretty sure he loses it once he becomes a Stoutland. Or a Murando, as I know him from the Japanese version. Uh you know you'd think there'd be something here. Yeah, there you go. I found a great ball, man. What a great ball that is. You see that you see that girl shadow in the water? Holy crap. Or a reflection? Wow. You're gonna look at me and be like, Scientist Fennel's like, dang it, I forgot about that. I didn't want to do that, man. You're not a trainer, are you? No, you're not. You're just running around. Yeah, you're gonna teach me about TMs? I know. You get it? Because you're you're working up right now. You sh no, nobody works out anymore. Everyone works up. Yeah, friggin' Fennel's house. Go upstairs. Oh, ta-da, thanks to you, I got some Dream Mist, and now I can collect save files with various trainers. Thank you very much. As a token of my appreciation, I will give you the Sea Gear to use. The Sea Gear is advice related to communication, such as infrared connection or Nintendo Wi-Fi connection, which is no longer around. It's been debunked, so there's no point in doing it. Kevin, you got this Sea Gear. Turn on the Sea Gear to establish... No. <laughs> it will be restricted. Yes. Okay, so it's going to be on the bottom screen, but there's nothing there. Then after turning on the power, if you touch the question mark at the bottom right on the screen, you can read about the Sea Gear, about Game Sync, and explain. You want to learn more? No. Uh, you're a great thing. Now Game Sync can retrieve memories of sleeping Pokemon using Dream Mist. That's right. We can collect safe files of trainers all over the world. What's more, we learned that if you use Game Sync to make a Pokemon sleep, it will have dreams. Then when you wake up a Pokemon, its dreams become a reality in the place called the Entrelink in the middle of the Unova region. Isn't Games Inc. interesting? If you like, please send your save file. I've summed up the details in the PC, so please check it if you have a chance. Uh, oh, trainer, thank you very much for helping. Fennel, this is from me. Please take it, don't be shy. We've got a little thing. I don't know what that is. Oh, it's the pal pad. I don't give a crap. I don't give a crap. I don't give a crap. I don't, I don't, I don't give a crap. I don't, I don't give a crap about a pal pad? You little stupid butt face. I don't give a crap about you well 
Well, considering all these services are debunked, it doesn't really matter. In fact, there's nothing here. If I, if I press the power button. Oh, I have to turn it on? I don't want to turn it on. It's too much work. It drains your battery too, even though I'm plugged in. So we don't use see gear, but now the pretty much all that was, so our bottom screen's gonna look different. That's it. It might, like, I'm sure if we turn it on, things will happen with the wireless stuff, but there's no Wi-Fi connection anymore, so I don't even really care. Well, to route number three, we're here, we made it, bruh. Sometimes they let us play with Pokemon. Also, so here we are at the daycare. This is the daycare of the game, it's a big deal. And take care of your precious Pokemon. Also, this is a human daycare next to the Pokemon daycare. Get it? It's, I mean, you'd think they would put them together. Are you, no, oh, why did I say no? I should've said yes. I know what that is, and what do you say? Hmm, your Pokemon, they don't seem to be healthy. Let me, we just left town. We didn't even get into a battle yet. Oh my lord, this game, this game. Oh boy, okay. I'm gonna continue on, and we're gonna get into a battle here just so we can use mana a little bit. Feel invincible because I am surrounded with po surrounded by the smiles of children and Pokemon. That's not a reason to feel invincible, but okay. It's fine. Hey there, in Nursery 8 Autumn. That's the that's actually the season we're in, in the game. Wow, what are the odds? If we were in winter, would you have been named winter? If we were in spring, would you Man, you ever notice that all the seasons can be first names? What's the deal with that? I'm gonna use I'm scared of your bite. Actually, yeah. Because of that, I'm gonna switch. <laughs> I was thinking like, ah, oh, friggin' Lollipop, we're just gonna kick his butt. And then I remembered he has a dark move, and I'm like, God, shoot! <laughs> get out, get out while you can, you're gonna lose. Ow. Forewarned, coming through. Coming through with my OCD. Dang, mana. Back at it again with the... <laughs> Time to date the video with the whatever current meme is around. My phone just vibrated, I shouldn't keep it on the table, because you'll hear it in the microphone. Why are you faster than me? Because I got brave. So, I mean, I am going to be slower, and that's... Nothing's worse than when your starter Pokemon has low speed. You have a mana too? Well, I would beat you. Oh, we're gonna yawn it? That's what we gotta start with. You gotta yawn that thing. You can defense curl all you want, you're done. You just like each other if you want, I don't get crits. Oh no, I'm so upset. I'm so upset. I don't care. Oh, I shouldn't use tackle, because use defense curl. I'm dumb. I'm really dumb. You are really dumb. For real. Ah, <laughs> oh, using the water gun. Oh. Using the water gun. Using the water gun. Using the water gun. Yeah. Um. There we go. There goes the mana. Mana defeated. See, at least Oshawott's not my slowest Pokemon, because Mana's gonna be slower for like the majority of the game, and probably forever, because of her cloud. I remember their names. I'm, I'm really bad at remembering their nicknames. But it's okay. Uh, you can play a double battle against these kids, and there's a sandbox, and who doesn't want to play in a sandbox where you find an Ultra Ball? <laughs> I was just hitting A button for like no reason, I found an Ultra Ball. Hey, hello. Once we get the dousing machine in this game, it would be really good. Um, we'll definitely battle some more trainers and stuff. Maybe I'll do it off screen, especially since there's a double battle right here. I guess, oh, I guess this is a decent place to end the episode. So, next time, or what did we do in this episode of Pokemon White? We did, saved Mana. We did, proud. Yay, we got Mana and we did some battling. We got our new teammate. So anyway, next time, the Pokemon White version. We're going to continue down this route, and I mean, I think we have a town map. Let's look at the map. Let's see where we're going. Let's see where we're going on the map, because I got to remember what this map looks like. Also, we're going to register this. We're gonna use the town map. Uh, we're starting here, and we're gonna go to Nacreen City, which is where the second gym is, and it's just down the road. Also, there's a pinwheel forest here, and there's a, a, a wellspring cave here. We're gonna go to all these places, but that will be next time. So, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you guys all next time. Thanks for watching again, because I have to say that multiple times, because I'm bad. Huh. <sighs>